What a night, what a night. Last it three days. She sent me over a pan of sausages for a tea. I meet a wee mate. Next thing you know, it's Thursday. <laughs> well, that's me, you know. I'm a free spirit. I love you for sentimental reasons. <laughs> but most of all, I love you because you're all you. <laughs> that's me back, Mary Allen. Cheers. I'm sorry I'm late, you know, but there was a hell of a queue at Prestos. No, yeah, yeah, we, a wee bag of sweeties just to say how much I care. Thanks very much, da. I'm a wee bit of crush on you myself. Shut it, you. Oh, yeah. Where's your mother? That was sore. Never mind the sore. Where's your mother? Oh, she's in the bedroom, back your suitcase. A suitcase? What for? Family, son, have you seen my slippers? Is that him back? I don't know, Ma. Wait, I'll ask. Is that you back, Dad? Oh, <laughs> hey, blame me. It's either Wayne's that's suffering a marital breakup. <laughs> marital breakup? Mar <laughs> uh, Mary, darling, is there something wrong? I detect unpleasantness here. Yeah. You're bloody right, you do. Oh, I've had my fill of you, Abner's, but I'm sick of you and your drunken carrying on of your low life pals. You are totally irresponsible. See that way in there? That way has got more responsibility than his wee finger than you've got your whole body. Aye, and that's through you, my trigger finger. <laughs> What's oh, that that's it. Excuse me, by the way. Gonna use keep your army doing it. I mean, I'm trying to winch a lassie through there. <laughs> yeah, plut face. You want to take a good deck with this? This will be used in a few years' time. <laughs> hey, bitch, get your coat on. You're leaving. <laughs> You're going. After all, we've been through together. It's because of all we've been through together that I'm gone. Honest to Christ, don't be your eyes. Look at us. Look at the way we're living. Right, more that's us away. I wouldn't bring a dog back to a place like this. You would, wouldn't you? You should see some of the hounds he's had by the way, dog. <laughs> Just you wait till I get you. Who? <laughs> oh, you got that, will you? See ya. Separate. Separate. Am I here and right here? After all I've done for you, after all the love I've splattered on you over here. You're gonna give me the hips, will you? Is that it? Is that it? Oh, don't you start all that rabbin' this bit. I sent you out for a pan of sausages three days ago and I haven't seen hiding or hair of them yet. Sausages, sausages, what are you calling me, Mary? Sa Sauce, I've got here. That's what the smell was here, Mary. Look here. Look, there's your sausages. I don't want them, no. They used to be no, are they? Mary, come on. We have known each other too long to let a pun of deed meat come between us. Let's leave our sex life out of this, will we? What smells worse? Poor marriage, are they bloody sausages? Well, I have had enough, boy. I am tired of being a scumball. I want respectability. I'm off. I will go well. Bloody well go. Go on. And good bloody ribs. Go on, Peter. I'm sick carrying you in my back. Hey, ya! Well, they're all the same, they're all the same. How are you, Ada? Eh? You've certainly got away with the chicks. Shut it, you! Give me that! <laughs> Who needs that? <laughs> Bitch! Yes. Respectability? That's a terrible thing to ask any man. All I'm saying is, that's the whole point about the bunch, isn't it? It's a nest building, it's nest building. Eh? I mean, left to his own devices, what does the average bloke need, eh? Nothing. We're hunters. All we need is the jungle, a cave, and a dirty big club in our hands. That's right, that's all we need. Well, apart from maybe a nice three piece sweet and central heat on a white meat, but otherwise. <laughs> ah, and these chinsy bedroom curtains that suit new with the matching valances, have you seen that? No. no. <laughs> Pure gallus, so they are. Come years later, I'll show you the lovely pelmet about Oh, oh, we will, we will, eh? Here, 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 you listen to us. There you are, there you are, that's what I'm talking about. I mean, what the hell is happening here so these days? It's the new man, Rab. Adapt or die. Eh, Dougie, eh? Don't even want a wee squish of that Evian water in there. <laughs> of course, you know your trouble, Nesbitt? Special pleading. Just because your marriage broke up, you expect the rest of us ought to feel guilty. Not at all, not at all. You listen here. You listen. I am a waster. 
My father before me was a waste. There, and I'll tell you, the woman is not alive. The woman is yet to be born. That'll turn me into a respectable wooden man. Yeah. <laughs> Ram, you and I understand each other, Ram, because we are scum. And I may say that as scum, in my estimation, you float right to the top of the something. Thank you very much, Jim. That means a hell of a lot to me. Sorry, I'm sorry. But I'm just saying this. I know you are a born waster. And a good day you could waste for Scotland. <laughs> Listen. Is it worth sacrificing your marriage for your career? I know, James, I mean, I know, I know it's a hell of a, hell of a decision, but... Well, I don't even know whether I'm going to be able to make it. Look at this, look at it. It's for the SS. Dear sir, you will neither work nor want. Take a job or we will stop your dodge. Come in tomorrow or else. Love the government. <laughs> I mean, I'm paraphrasing, James, I'm paraphrasing, you know. But, I mean, that is just it. Christ almighty, Robert, it's not been your day, has it? Oh, it's not, James, it's not. No. What is it, then? I'm just waiting for the third thing to happen. You know what they say, bad luck comes in threes. Hey, Rab, hey, have you left your two boys in to get the rain dinner? Hey, hey. Well, you better get back there pronto. I think they're burning the house down. <laughs> Boys, you got a nice day for it, eh? <laughs> and what in the name of hell have you two been up to? It wasn't my fault, Dad. It was him. He started dabbling with unknown. What do you mean? What do you mean? Well, he wanted to find out how the cooker worked. No, we can walk in here. Look, that. Look, I was just trying out my cuisine. Well, listen, you hear to me. If the good Lord had wanted us to know about cuisine, he would never have given us crispy pancakes! <laughs> That's right. That's right. Blame me. But none of this would have happened if you hadn't acted such a pig with my maw. Uh, I'm off. Hey, hey! There you go! Who's it? A lot of good riddance. Hey! Put my sock up! Well, I've got to hit some, haven't I? Hey, you're bloody well smart now, you big swine. So just wait till you get your heart disease. Then I'm going to bloody well kill you! Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, boy. That's my boy. <laughs> Mr. Nesbitt. That's me, pal. Here I come, boy. <laughs> All right, sonny boy, eh? <laughs> what can I do for you? Well, you can show me some respect for a start. Now then, Mr. Nesbitt, I see from this form that you haven't worked for some time. Eighteen years, to be exact. <laughs> I do. I crash. Time flies when you are enjoying yourself, doesn't it? Yes, well, that's just not good enough, is it? Everyone has to work, Mr. Nesbitt, or perhaps you disagree. Disagree? Of course I disagree. Of course I disagree. Listen, you hearing me? There is a working population in this country at 20 million. There is only 17 million jobs to get in. So some poor bugger's got to be in the brew, haven't they? So, may as well be him that likes it. And I'll tell you this, I'll lap it up like a dummy titten awesome up. Yes, well, I'm afraid the system doesn't work in that way. We must all pull our weight in life. Now then, here's a list of community enterprise vacancies. You ought to choose one now or forfeit your benefit. I don't want a job. I don't want a job. Yes, well, we must all do things we don't want to do in life, Mr Nesbitt. <laughs> hey! I just, I just saw the door shut by him. Hey! How do you know just black me up and send me out to pick cotton and I've done with it? Thank you, Mr. Nesbitt. We'll be getting in touch. See? See? Well, I will tell you this, boy. I will tell you this. I will take your job. I'll take your job. I'll take it. I will never work, never. I will skive, skive, and skive again to save the lifestyle I love. Do I make myself clear? Perfect. Well, work, boy, work. Don't just sit there. 
I'm paying taxes to keep the lights in you. <laughs> Christa! Well, Dad, what happened? How did you go into the job shop? Bad news, son. I got a job. <laughs> oh, well, that's good news, too. Where's Gaff? Ah, it's the good news. He's pissed after my grannies. He wants to love my ma. I see, it's like that, it's like that, eh? One by one of the circles, eh? Oh, well, that is it, then, that's it, eh? It is you and me against the world new, Burnley, son. It's just like Kramer versus Kramer. Aye, <laughs> except Meryl Streep with a bigger chest than my ma. Don't you worry, boy, don't you worry. You want a big chest, you will get a big chest. Well, can Meryl Streep beat that? That's what I admire about you, Da. You're all things to all men. You'd better believe it, boy. You'd better believe it. Moon. I'll tell you something. She me. She the she. I love the she me. I mean, she when you stand here, it's, uh, well, look new to it. It makes you feel humble, you know. I mean, that's how I picked this job, actually, for the humility. <laughs> the white boy, I said, the white boy! That's the red boy! What did I tell you, the white boy? That's the red boy! That's the white boy! And the right boy, you're told! Who you're told? We crud! Swines that we are! Swines! You see that, James? It's swines! Being single doesn't suit you, Rab. You're awful crabber these days. Garbage! The sweet nature as ever I was. Oh. Oh. Mm. What's the matter with your face? These pussies, da. They're minging. Where did you get the, the felons? Scrape off the sole of your shoe. Yeah, hey, I, I don't know what's good for you, are we? You see that? Did you see that? Eh? Wayne's, Jamesy Wayne's. Eh? Oh. Hey, I seen Mary the day, Rab. Mary? Did you speak? Aye. Well, kinda. She said hello. But what I mean is, James, he was, you know, was there, was there an undercurrent, you know? I mean, did she say hello, but secretly meant an ache for big rab and a tickle bite and a shot just to be cheer the word? Hey, I mean, was it one of the aching of hellos? No, she just said hello, rab. <laughs> Bitch! Don't hit her! <laughs> and what are you trying to say, eh? That I keep a dusty hoose. Oh, hey! Like... Hold on, I'm here, I'm here. Come on! Beat that! Beat that! Come on! I'm in the quiet. Now, Rab, I'm not trying to interfere nor nothing here. Oh. I need to be able to do evil. Because, you know, Rab, as far as I'm concerned, marriage is a secret institution. Oh, I know that, James, yeah, I know that. I mean, you attend confession religiously every time you knock hell out of hell. <laughs> but it's a fact, Rab. He bunches funny things. You have to be sensitive to their needs. Is that a fact? Right. See, sometimes they need a right good gubbin. Sometimes they need to be wooed. Wooed? You take it from here, Ab. You knock round to her mother's and get a right good wooing. She'll come back to you straight away. You're hell of a concern about me all of a sudden, Jamesy. Well, that's cos I'm sentimental, Rap. And I am not speaking to you only as your best man here, Rab. I'm also speaking to you as your pool's agent. No, no, I mean, no offence, big man. It's just that, well, since Mary's went away... Well, you're on me three weeks. You'll get your money. You'll get your bloody money. Well, well I tell you what, Rab. I could knock round there and have a word with her. No, cos she'll, she'll listen to me. Never. Never. Don't you dare. Because I will tell you this, boy. I will tell you this. She's away. And she can stay away. Because Rab seen is but pigs, for no woman, for no woman. You suit yourself, big man. I mean, if that's the way you want it, I will not go against your wishes. Rab, here's your gaffer. I think I'll just shoot a crow. Hey, go on, we go, go on, beat it, beat it. Did you see that there? Yeah? Hey. You see the flyness of me there? <laughs> yeah. I don't know going against your wishes, Rab. 
Well, that'll be right. First opportunity, I'll begin at Big Licks with the old sweetie mouth. <laughs> but that suits me fine. Suits me fine. That'll soften her up, you know. She'll just be ready to melt into my arms when I give it the old seductive overtures about getting her ass back of the couch. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's how you've got to treat the bins. That is how you've got to treat them. Don't bend the knee. Do not bend the knee. Hey, Nesbitt. I thought I told you to get all those leaves swept up. Shake a leg. Pronto. Shaking it, boss. Shaking it. <laughs> Fair enough. Maybe shake the leg. Do not bend the knee. Do not bend the knee. <laughs> Brushing, boss. Brushing. In the forces, what do the initials KOSB stand for, Jimmy? King's own Scottish borderers. King's own Scottish borderers is right, and at the end of that round, Jimmy... I don't want to see him there, eh? It's pathetic, so it is. How do you mean? He's respectable. He gets up in the morning, goes to his work, and has a quiet pint every Saturday night. That doesn't he sound like Rab? No. See, since you left him, he's went right uphill. <laughs> So is, but of course that's what respectability does to you. It does terrible things to a man. Ah oh, well, nine o'clock. Time for bed, mister. <clears throat> that's another day in, mother. <clears throat> Not long now before we take the long dark journey. <laughs> yes. No. Yes. <laughs> Quietly, mother. Show some restraint. Enthusiasm is common. Right, feather. <laughs> That's all very well, Jamesy. But Rab brung this on himself. Now he's paying the price. And what a price it is, Mary. Honestly, if you could just see his face. Don't tell me anymore. It's just upsetting me. If Rab wants me back, he can do his ain asking. I'm sick, fed up, and kowtowing every time it suits him. <laughs> <laughs> For having your father's eyes. <laughs> Take a pack? Never! Never! Ten thousand times never! Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, bloody thing! <sighs> what did she say anyway, James? Well, like I say, sir, I, I mean, I just heard it through the grapevine, like, you know. But, I mean, I say you weren't interested. Cos I... I say that you were getting on fine with her, you know. <laughs> well, bloody right I'm getting on fine with her, bloody right! Women, is it? Women! I will tell you this, boy, I am a better woman than she'll ever be. In fact, see, if I wasn't married, I'd invite myself away for a dirty weekend. Yeah. Right, I'll well, just say you are not interested. Hey, ho, 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 ho. Hold on, hold on. <clears throat> Listen, you and I have known each other a long time. Am I right? You speak the truth, Rab. And to, to blokes like you and me, marriage, I mean, is a secret institution, correct? You are right. So... If the surface slag wants to come back to me, I mean, well, it's no right that I should give her the rubber here, eh? See, you're a... you're a prince among men. No. You're better than that. You're no a bad fella. Yeah. Well, you're no a bad fella yourself, James, yeah. <laughs> well, here, uh, remember, James, uh, this, is, uh, this is personal, you know. So I know I want to nobody, you hear? Certainly not, Ramp. I would sooner have my sex organs pickled in vinegar. I'll be some queer seafood in the pubs of govern this weekend. Come on. What's this? Beef curry. There we go. Beef curry. Feeds a family of four. Look at that. Feeds a family of four. I mean, four what? White mice. <laughs> Tell you this, boy. 
And it might not be by its sell-by date, but it's long past its knock-by date. You know what I mean? <laughs> Mummy's home! Oh, I've got a surprise for a night's tea! <laughs> You'll have to eat it out my trouser leg! <laughs> What's this? Dear Da, this pen is running out, so I will lean extra hard on it so you can read the imprint of the table. <laughs> See you! She your cooking. It uh, is puke, by the way. <laughs> so I am off to live at my granny's. Also, you are running out of continued inside the food cabinet. Running out. Running out. Running out. Ah! <laughs> Cornflakes. <laughs> All the best. Burn me. What did you make of that, did you? <laughs> look. Look. After I caught him a four pack of garlic special from feeling his old level prelim. <laughs> I want you, Mary. You're my wife. I want you back. Life's not the same without you, Mary. I see. Well, if I did come back, things would have to change. Well, you name it, Mary, you name it. And but just come back to me. In the name of Christ, come back. Right. Well, first of all, I want a rise in my housekeeping. Well, I don't need any housekeeping, Mary. <laughs> exactly that. All right, Mary, all right. What else? Then I want sexual satisfaction ten times a week. Aye, and matinees every Sunday. <laughs> Get in there, you! What did I tell you about dressing up my clothes? Got a wee pair back there. Me! 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 <laughs> oh, I, so plant your bowls. I mean, me, I mean, I mean, so, so. Oh, hello, Rap. And you want to join with Gartman Club? <laughs> you lot want the same? Oh, love a double, 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 big man. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this, look at this. More tasty treats from the bird's eye loser range, eh? Yeah. Hey, fun living in your jack, pal, is it? Don't worry, don't worry. It gets easier once you start talking to yourself. You always find you've got company. <laughs> Chocolates at this time of year. <laughs> don't worry, it's a killer. <laughs> yes, but let buzz without a battery. Ah, and is it in bad <laughs> Hey, dog. I'm helpless. Thanks to mother me. It's not a mother you need, it's a wet nurse. Mary! How are you getting this? But since when did you like powdered milk? And you left me. I suck it up my dental plate in the small hours of the morning. <laughs> a substitute for my oats. And who is this? We're not getting that. We'll get the rain make, it's three pence cheaper. We, oui, Mary. Did you say? We? Oui. You deaf as well as Glick. 
You had. Bring this to as well. <laughs> the hell, I'm paying for this. I'm celebrating. <laughs> oh, did he hear that? He's not even got a drink out of here. Fair enough. The perfection's boring, isn't it? <laughs> Tell you one thing, boy. Nash building is a work, is it? You can stuff the bloody lot. Because I will tell you this, boy. See when you get right down to it, right down to the bottom line. It's blokes that's the gentle sex. We're the ones that's the simple souls. I mean, give us a, a hot dinner at one end and a warm gun at the other. And we're as happy as pigs in glabber. You see the bents? See the bents? <laughs> they might be soft on the outside, but see on the inside. I've got hearts on them like hygiene of work tops. <laughs> Grafton, boss. Grafton. Nesbitt, Nesbitt, are you still at it? She is going to get it. She is going to get it. How long does it take you to sweep up a few leaves, for goodness sake? It's no my fault. It's no my fault. It's nature, isn't it? It's nature. <laughs> Hey, I mean, giving it a big blow, giving it a big waft. I mean, if I've done that size, it blows right in that size. If I've done that size, it, it blows right out my kyber and scatters the bloody lot. Hey. I mean, what am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? I am just a man. Naked, I come into this world, and on a string summit, I will go out of it. I mean, who am I? Who am I to disturb the universe? I see. Well, Nesbitt, if you can do the job, maybe I should get somebody else who can. I will tell you this. It is a good job I had my wings before I came into this job. Because I'll tell you, I would not have had the toy dolls for the afterwards. Here, Rob, I brought you a piece if you forgot them. Hey, I'll not have time to eat those. He's got far too much work to do. Oh, no? Who says? I do. I am an area administrator for the Parks and Amenities Department and, effectively, your husband's employer. I say. Oh, I see. I see. <laughs> well, I'm just a wee housewife. No, I don't have the big career or the fancy talk or nothing like that, so I wouldn't even attempt to argue with you. Good. No, instead, I'll get right down to it and give you the severe malky. <laughs> I'm the man. That's my job. <laughs> this is a modern marriage. We share the work. See that? You see that, eh? What a woman, what a woman. She's got me spoiled rotten. 